Wait, he's talking to... the treasure hoarders? You know what I'm here for, I trust. Oh, you got lip. Making us guess, are you? If you want to join up, let me just say this first. Dandy kid like you, you ain't welcome. Why does he sound like Raph? <laughs> uh ho! -huh. What a commendable imagination. Well, in the Tsaritsa's name, I suppose I should forgive you, country bumpkins, for your ignorance. For I am... Brother! Dude. Dude! You're selling them toys, aren't you, brother? That's so cool. I've always wanted to watch you work. This is gonna end badly. Uh, well, why, yes, of course. For I am, uh, the greatest toy salesman in Shnezhnaya. This kid, this, 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 this. Ah! Oh. This is not gonna end well. <sighs> so cool. Huh? You playing games, pretty boy? <laughs> so, will you buy or not? The toys that Shnezhnaya produced three months ago will run you... Yes, 600,000 mora. To be paid in full. The toys And <laughs> how much money? You heard him, dude. Wow. Is that what it's gonna cost to fix that head of yours? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! Spreading joy and laughter to everyone! That's what toy selling's all about! <laughs> I'll say it again. Toys from Shnezhnaya, three months prior, 600,000 mora paid in full. Yeah. Yeah, no. Sorry, salesboy. The same joke isn't funny twice. Or were you always cruising for a bruising? Cruising. No, just joking. <sighs> All right, then. I'll make things a little easier for you. I'll join the treasure hoarders. Perhaps you'll be more willing to pay when we're brothers in arms? <laughs> Would you listen to yourself? You think we just let any old person into the treasure hoarders? I'm not so sure you could hack it. <laughs> well then, why don't you put me to the test, dear seniors? I like to think of myself as quite talented in the field of treasure hunting. <laughs> Looks like you're not gonna pack it up until someone packs you in. Alright then, show us what you got. Oh dear. Truth be told, we've set up a shop here because there's a fine little loot cave nearby. But the treasure hasn't been easy to get at. We've been at it for two days now. If you think you're up to snuff, why don't you have a crack at it on our behalf? Of course, that means that once you got it, it's ours. Don't try to sneak off with the prize now. <laughs> Come on! If we can't do it, do you really think this guy stands a chance? Hmm. An initiation test, eh? Interesting. It's been a while since I've been assessed by someone else. Yeah, you guys really should underestimate this the guy. The boot's on the opposite cliff. We're gonna hang back here and watch the show. Huh, no problem. Don't blink, though, or you might miss it. Claim the treasure within 80 seconds. Okay. Ah, oh, play this child! <gasps> Yay! No, a buffer. No buffer. Wow. That wasn't bad. You done? Well, I have the goods. Here you go. So how'd I do? Pretty well, I'd say. B brother what do we do? This fellow isn't normal. Of course not. Please, hold on a moment, sir. We need to discuss something amongst ourselves. They're gonna backstab us. He ain't here for an initiation. He just wanted to show off. Yeah, I guess his brother's right in front of him. Honestly, we'd be no match for him if he wanted to fight. Guys, do you think that maybe we're being robbed? <laughs> More than likely. I don't know. Surely he wouldn't have come here all dressed up like that if he was only after us. Unless... 
But maybe his words have hidden meaning. You just now figured that out, Sherlock. Snezhnaya, three months, 600,000. Oh, I get it. It was insider talk. I remember that the boss took out a 600,000 more alone from that Snezhnaya bank about three months ago and still hasn't repaid it. So this guy must be the debt collector. But why didn't he just say so? What's with all the toy talk? Because his brother's in front of him. <laughs> and that's where you're still green. See, in a lot of professions like this, people speak in code to protect the privacy of their business partners and clients. Makes sense. Owing money is pretty embarrassing. This guy isn't one to mess with, I tell you. He's a professional. Way too professional. So, Mr. Salesman, my apologies, but we can't have you joining us. Oh? I didn't pass? I must say, I never imagined that the treasure hoarders would have such strict entry requirements. No, it's not that. What we mean is that you're too big a fish for our little pond. But we fully understand the situation with the... Uh, toys, sir. We'll fetch that 600,000 for you right away. Uh. <laughs> I see. Well then, it's been a pleasure doing business with you. We get paid, and everyone stays happy. A wonderful outcome, wouldn't you say? Yep. Uh, yes. Uh, couldn't agree more, sir. That's my brother for you! Toy sellers are so cool! Uh, it's a bit of a special case. Ah, Master Child, you're here. Oh, Felix, go away. A new batch of fresh recruits have just... Hey now, keep your voice down. Can't you see I'm entertaining some clients over here? Clients? Uh, well, anyway, the Motherland has dispatched a new batch of recruits to Liyue. They've just arrived, and I'm afraid we must trouble you to speak to them. Ah, uh, do I have to? Now is hardly the best time. Yeah, at this rate, Tusu's just gonna run away. I must apologize for troubling you, Master Child, but they are already waiting for you south of Lingju Pass. Every new batch of recruits must be baptized by the Tsaritsa's will, through the words of her harbingers. This has always been our rule. Uh, I can see. At present, Master Child, you are the only harbinger in Liyue. Please, everyone is standing in formation and waiting for you to bestow this honor upon them. <sighs> well, all right then, I'll go. Just give me a moment to catch up with my brother, and I'll be right with you. Do you have to keep working? Yes. Yes, too, sir. We have a group of new toy sellers fresh in from the motherland, and I need to go teach them the ropes. Wow, that's great! When I grow up, I want to be a toy seller, too. Can I go listen? Nah, uh, no. Hmm. I'm afraid you're still too young, too, sir. I'm not sure if you'd understand much of it, and most of it's rather boring anyhow. Why don't you go play with the Traveler instead? Sound good? You're dubbing on, on, on us again. But, but... I really do have to go now, too, sir. A lot of people are waiting to see me. I'll see you around, all right? Even I have grown. Child really dotes on his brother. But now he's got to ditch him again. Must be a really tough job. I think covering up is the tough part. Yeah, you're right. He hasn't done himself any favors with the whole toy seller cover story. Exactly. To think he'd go this far just to prevent his family from seeing his dark side. He's being a bit overprotective. I wonder how much longer he can hide it from two, sir. Paimon wonders too. But hey, let's at least help him out while we're all in Liyue. Wait. Uh, where's two, sir? We take his eye. We take his eye, eye, eye off for one second, and he's gone. Ah, oh, we were too busy chatting. Where'd he go? I uh, guess he probably snuck off to follow his brother. Uh, seems likely. Tuser did seem really eager to hear his brother's speech. Yep. Either way, let's head over there first. <sighs> Did I find two? Yeah, okay. Two, sir! Okay. So you did come here! 
Don't ever run like that again, young man. <laughs> Shh, quiet! My brother's giving his speech. Oh, okay, here we go. From this day forward, you will honor the oaths you have made to Her Majesty the Tsaritsa, and you will stop at nothing to bring Snezhnaya victory. Okay, this isn't bad. You shall sweep through this land like the icy winds of the furthest north, as strong as the hoarfrost of Zeppeljarni Palace. You will chill the very marrow in our enemy's bones. Zep Zeppeljarni? That's a name. Her Majesty expects of you loyalty, ruthlessness, and meticulousness. For the trials that we face are harsh, and our enemies are like... Uh, <laughs> oh, oh! I I cringe for for Thailand. <laughs> and like kites oh, and no. rattle drums. <laughs> oh man! It feels so bad for Thailand. <laughs> okay. Who shall become redoubtable foes of Mr. Cyclops in the marketplaces <laughs> of Liu? <Lyra. laughs> I can't watch this. This is terrible. I can't watch. Oh, if only you just came clean to his little brother. Uh -huh. <laughs> Kites are really fun, too. Oh, goodness. <laughs> They're pretty probably confused. Yeah. <laughs> They're confused. This is, of course, an analogy. Oh, my As goodness. they say, the marketplace, too, is a battlefield. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, I, I weep. Hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> They're all like, okay, whatever, whatever you say, dude. So as your sales manager no. here in Liyue, I demand that you obey my every order. I feel so bad for him. Dude, you need to come clean to your brother. <laughs> it would be so much easier. A refusal shall be considered a betrayal. And the mm. price for betrayal is to be dishonorably discharged from... <clears throat> uh, oh, from the new Institute of Toy Research. I can't. Can I just skip through all this? I don't want to see him suffer. <laughs> oh, that's really strict. Won't people be really sad if they get fired from the Institute? <laughs> I feel the Traveler right now. Huh? <laughs> <sighs> Child. The poor thing. Seeking to please everyone pleases no one at all. Time to try something else. Obviously! <laughs> this is why you don't try to please everyone. Forget it. Perhaps a round of hands-on training will suit us better. Ah, oh, here we go. Hands-on training? After all, uh, a strong body is the proof of one's capacity. <sighs> hey, did... Did he just say that we're doing hands-on training? Oh, dear. A harbinger wants to spar with us personally? Oh, what an honor. <sighs> if only they knew. I can't believe it. Are recruits like us really worthy? No, dude. If you only knew. Am I hearing a hint of objection to this idea? <laughs> Not, Not at, at all, sir. sir! That's the spirit. Now come at me, you lot. Uh, do we get to fight? Eh, hey, get the fighter's child! I'm so happy. Oh, here we are. Frozen. Crisp. No time to lose. Nope. 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 Who's next? Yeah. Brace yourself. This is gonna hurt. What is it? Is it cryo that takes down the shield? I have to use cryo. Yeah. 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 
Excellent. And you all almost managed to get me limbered up. Ha. In other words, you've done well for new recruits. This dude. Thank you, Lord Harbinger! <laughs> all right, hush now. <clears throat> now then, I wish you all glorious victory for Snezhnaya, for Her Majesty the Tsaritsa, and for yourselves. Dismissed! Okay, can we now just have you spend time with him so we just have Ron, Ron uh, running all over Liwe? Brother! You are amazing! Oh, Tusser, what in the world are you doing here? There I was thinking that the Traveler had taken you to play at Wang Xuin. <laughs> <laughs> that laugh. Yikes, that's some terrible acting. Forgive me if you hear some very annoying sounds because I just have a paleta that my mom brought up for me. So, and I don't want to go back down and put it in the freezer. So, here we go. Um, you really did get stronger. <laughs> I told you, didn't I? I never pass on an opportunity to improve my strength. Okay. <laughs> I'm not the man I was when we first met. You didn't go all out, though. By that, I assume you mean that I didn't use the foul legacy transformation, yes? Yep. I am terribly sorry for y'all for this sound. <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to do that. So, I apologize. It puts a great strain on my body, so it's best saved for crucial moments. Is it now? So you saying their fight was a, a crucial moment? You mean by week by week? <laughs> wink wink. <laughs> I still haven't fully recovered from the injuries I suffered when I used it at the Golden House. Oh, that's because I'm fighting you like every week. Anyway, I'm no senora. I don't use lethal force against recruits. Come on now. I can see how she could be a tyrant, in a way. The foul legacy transformation? It doesn't make you stronger than Mr. Cyclops? That is a good question, my young sir. Uh, you could say that. I want to learn to fight too. I want to be cool like you. Now too, sir. Fighting isn't about looking cool. You can only continue to get stronger if you know the reason why you're fighting. Oh yeah? Why do you fight? I can teach you, but think carefully first. Why do you want to fight? I... Hmm? It's a good... That is a good question. He's not doing it just because, like, he cares for Tuther, but because... It is a good question. A lot of people just do it for the wrong reasons, and even though Child is part of the Fatui, uh, his heart is in the right place, I guess, because he's, like, doing it to protect his family. Hopefully. Am I right? <laughs> I... I want to protect Sister Tonya. Well, I can't wait to meet her. That's a good answer, too, sir. When I return to Snezhnaya, I will start teaching you fighting techniques. Then you'll have to protect Tonya for me. How does that sound? <laughs> Leave it to me! You know, Tuser's a good kid when he's not being so stubborn. Protecting family is an admirable motivation. You've had a nice long time here in Liyue, haven't you, Tuser? Isn't it about time that you took the boat back home? <laughs> We didn't get any time to play together yet. Too, sir, you know I'm very busy at work. And hasn't it been fun traveling all over the place with a proper traveler? He's just worried he won't be able to keep up the toy seller act forever. Yeah. Well, how about this? If you just do one little thing for me, I'll be a good boy and go back home. 
Oh, and what's that? Oh dear, who taught this little devil to bargain? <laughs> All right, what'll it be? Uh, that would be us on accident. <laughs> we were negotiating, um... <laughs> Take me to visit the Institute of Toy Research! Oh dear, here we go. Do you think he means that ruin that the Millilith was talking about? The one where all the ruin guards were coming from? A risky wish. Done deal. After all, you've come all this way for me too, sir. He's such a good big brother. <laughs> but dude! As your brother, it's only right for me to grant you one last wish before you leave. Exactly! <laughs> Um, are you sure this is a good idea? It doesn't seem like the best place for kids. I thought so exactly. You should come along too, Traveler. This time, it's Tuser's turn to take you sightseeing. What do you mean by that? Hmm, let me think. Ah, yes, the Institute of Toy Research is not far at all from Lingju Pass. Now, Traveler, you're not the sort of person who would disappoint a kid now, are you? They're ganging up on me. <laughs> the brothers are ganging up on us again. Oh, fine. We'll go. <laughs> All right. On to Unju Pass. Oh, yay. Yeah, we're here. I can already hear the sounds of machinery inside. Awesome. What is this place? And how do you know about it? Based on my limited understanding, I believe this is one of Dottore's research facilities. I don't know who Dottore is. I have only read like... If I'm, if I'm correct, Dottore is another harbinger, right? Um... <clears throat> I know this because I heard about the comic, the web comic, or the yeah, the web comic from YouTube. Um, and I've seen you know I've seen the guy who wears a mask and looks like a clown, a psychopathic clown. Um, so is that him? It can't be Scaramouche because I've seen clips of Scaramouche, and I know what he looks like. Dottore is another one of the Fatui Harbingers. He loves tinkering with old things. It's a personal passion of his. So, he converted these ruins into a Ruin Guard research lab. Has he now? Huh? So the Ruin Guards are built by the Fatui? No, they have much closer connections to the Abyss. So, strictly speaking, they're as much our enemies as anyone else's. We just do research, nothing more. As to why the Ruin Guards have been moving outside of this area recently, I can only imagine that he's gotten bored of playing around with them, and has lost interest in this place. I can see that. Wow, yet another Harbinger with a bad attitude. Yeah, it seems like they're full of them. But at least this explains why you were totally okay with bringing Tuser here. Seems you did your homework ahead of time. Hmm. Well, I wouldn't go quite that far. I actually have no idea what this place is like on the inside. But you do know of it, so you technically did research on it, you just haven't been inside. Wait, so are you or are you not worried about your brother's safety? Good question, by my Of course I am. But no matter what the danger is, I will parry it. Isn't that what any older brother would do? I wouldn't know. I don't have an older brother. I am the oldest. Ha 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 ha. Even Tuser understands that, now that he knows what he's fighting for. It's the very same reason that's been nestled in my own heart for so many years. What are you guys chatting about? Come on, let's go in! <laughs> Alright, follow me. This kid. <laughs> Yeah, the only Hydro character I have is Barbara and Shincho. 
technically that's a lie. Shincho is not. Uh, leveled up, as you can tell. See, I mean, he's leveled up. It's just that I haven't worked on him and I haven't used him yet. So. We're just going to continue we using Barbara. We can do this. I'm going to switch you up for sanding, though. I'll bring my seasonings. Because I'm still working on Klee. I just got her a few days ago. Oh, here I go. And then there's Child. Like, what's the point of me Brother, bringing Barbara? Someone was saying that Mr. Cyclops is a killing machine. Were they now? What a silly thing for them to say. And you shouldn't go repeating it either, Tuser. You're far too young to be talking about such violent topics. Uh, this kid is like, what, seven, eight? <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's fine. Yeah, I knew that they were lying anyways. Mr. Cyclops is here to defeat the bad guys and protect the world. He's my favorite toy. Dude. <laughs> right. With Mr. Cyclops around, the bad guys won't ever get you. <laughs> That's right. Okay, I'm going to go play with Mr. Cyclops now. Uh. Hey, too, sir. Wait up. Don't tell me we're gonna have to run after this kid in here. The, the door shut. Will Tuser be all right? No. He's a kid. There's another path over there. Let's move. And big mode act. A uh, little big brother mode activate. Okay, we gotta go in there. So we gotta go over here. Here we go. No time to lose. There we go. Bring it on. Ooh, I can see the ruin guards. Was that you? Boy? That's right. But give me a moment over here, too, sir. I need to make sure that everything's safe. <sighs> Maybe I shouldn't have spoiled him quite so much. Uh, B. I've never spoiled my sister growing up. What the heck? Give me the door. <laughs> Wow, it's like a factory. Have all been strung up. Where are they being taken to? I don't know, but if there's a chance it's where Tusser is, we need to stop this before things get ugly. Okay, I'm gonna break these. I potato. Well, at least Tusser doesn't have any like slimes or anything like that on his side. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Yeah. Shouldn't let your guard down. Yeah. Oh no! Amateur mistake. Are you telling me? Yeah. Who's next? Can't, 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 please, please. All I need. <gasps> Can I have my shield? Stabilize. <laughs> I will have order. Uh, stir treasure, nothing. Okay. Always look around for treasure. You never know where you might find it. Can I think of? Oz, reveal thyself. Nice and spicy. My palette has nothing. Thank you. <gasps> treasure juice. Ah. Yeah. 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 
Come here! Do not <sighs> run away from me! Hang on. Oh god. Po 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 po. Ah! Bamfi! Go, 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 go! Oh! Oh, here we go. Door. Mmm! That was cold! Tucer, see that big stone cube in front of you? I need your help. Yay! Do I really get to help my big brother out? Yes. You bet. Now I'll count down from three, and then we touch it together. Ready? Three. Two, one. Boy. Good job, too, sir. All right, now we move. I'm stuck. Is he okay? Wait, what am I doing? Oh. <laughs> That's bright. What is that? It's a witch ray that will turn you into a little lamb if it hits you. So stay out of its way. <gasps> That's scary. Um, what am I supposed to do? Oh, am I supposed to go over there? Yeah. Okay, do it again. Do it again. Come in. Yeah. Oh, makes me nervous. Can't climb. Come on, give me another one. Give me another one. There we go. I could get used to this. I can get used to you too. <laughs> no time to lose. Oh, what's going on? Oh. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Ah, no, come here. Oh, <sighs> back together at last. You're not hurt, are you, too, sir? Um, I don't think so. Uh -huh. No way. This is really fun. Fun for you, maybe. We were all scared to death. Uh, children. What's over there? Wow. Oh. This room is huge. Is this where Mr. Cyclops takes his friends when they come to visit? Uh, no. It is impressive, isn't it? <laughs> now, how about a little game of hide and seek? Tell them the truth. Huh? Now? Uh, but... <laughs> I have a surprise for you, you know. Mm. A surprise? Oh, what sort of surprise? Don't worry, you'll have the chance to look for it later. But before that, you have to close your eyes, turn around, and count down from 60. Oh, please tell me you're not going to give us the time limit. Okay, 60 is a really long time, though. All right, let's go. Sixty in sixty seconds. Fifty-eight. All right, just two. There's not much time. Let's clear all these hazards out. Break it! Break it! Break it! Break it! Forty-eight. Forty-seven. Forty-six. Forty-five. Are you guys okay? What's all that yep. crashing and banging? Don't worry. It's all part of the surprise. We can do it. Solidify. Sixteen. Twelve. Ten. Hey, no cheating. You skipped a few numbers, you little rascal. <laughs> <laughs> you notice. All right, all right. Fifteen. Fourteen. Thirteen. No way. Did we fail?
Okay, never mind. I thought I failed. Give me another 10 seconds, Tusser. Still hiding. Huh. Where's now Freckles? He's the cheater. All right. 10 seconds, that's it. <laughs> what? Ten, what? Nine, eight, oh. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Coming, ready or not? <laughs> what in the world? Give me that, child. <laughs> This is a surprise your brother prepared for you. Wow. He actually pulled it off. And the way he knocked those ruin guards around was like they really were kids' toys. Yeah. But Paimon wonders if he'll be alright after using the Valve Legacy transformation again. Awesome! <laughs> Boy, if these Mr. Cyclopses weren't so big, I'd sure love to take one home. <laughs> Where'd he go? Where'd my brother go? He's hiding, remember? Aren't you guys supposed to be playing hide and seek? Oh, that's right! I was so excited that I forgot all about our game! <laughs> well, let's go look for him together, okay? Yeah, okay, let's go find... I guess he's just gonna run around the whole time. Really hiding, are you? you two found me first. Looks like using the foul legacy transformation while I was still injured took more out of me than I thought. Well, you shouldn't have used it. I have no idea what I'd do if Tusser saw me like this. Look at me, deflated as a burst balloon. You're not afraid that I might end you right here? <laughs> as I recall, you have siblings too, yes? I figured that you probably wouldn't take me out in front of my little brother. Ugh. Man. Really milking this situation, huh? Like I said, I can never pass on an opportunity to test my limits. Dude, I think you went a little too far this time, though. And that's why I, Tartaglia, am always getting stronger. <laughs> anyway, childhood dreams are all too easily shattered, even if you just leave them be. They will fall to pieces all by themselves. Oh, that's why you did it. Okay. Now I understand. So someone has to protect them, right? If you make a promise, you keep it. If you make a mistake, you apologize. And if you give someone a dream, you defend it to the end. Nice philosophy. That is what family is all about, isn't it? <laughs> Remind you of something, did I? <coughs> Quit the tough guy act already! You need to see a doctor right away, mister! Uh, listen to Paimon. A fine suggestion, but first... I have a little something for Tusser. Please give it to him on my behalf. Huh? Is this... a Mr. Cyclops action figure? <laughs> Indeed. I had made it to order by a smith some time back. I had intended to give it to him on my return to Snezhnaya, but it seems that it would make a better souvenir at this point. Wow. Now that Paimon thinks about it, Child's family are really lucky to have him, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> I'll also need you to explain my abrupt departure to Tusser. You'll help me out, won't you? Make a pinky promise, you keep it all your life. I break a pinky promise, I get thrown on the ice. 
<laughs> the cold will kill the pinky that once betrayed your friend. The frost will freeze your tongue off so you never lie again. Yeah. Ah, that nursery rhyme brings back so many delightful memories. Tuser taught you that one, did he? Go in peace. All right. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. We'll babysit him till the end, I guess. Oh, it's a cute action figure! <laughs> All right, Tuser, let's get out of here. Stop running around. I can't find him anywhere. Where did he go? I found your brother, Mamadou. Really? Where is he? A huge number of people suddenly wanted to buy Mr. Cyclops's. Yeah, so he had to leave in a real hurry. He didn't abandon you here on purpose. Yeah. Oh, uh, well, that's great. But still, I was kind of hoping we could play here a little longer. Mr. Cyclops will keep you company in his stead. Wow, look at this! <laughs> I never knew that they made Mr. Cyclopses in this size! Oh. Uh, look, it even has my name on it! It's my very own Mr. Cyclops! Aww. <laughs> You're really loving it, huh? Yeah. You bet! My brother is the best big brother ever! Yeah, he is. <laughs> you had a tour of Lila, you met your brother, visited the Institute of Toy Research, and got yourself a souvenir. Now that's what we tour guides call the perfect trip. Uh-huh. Do you think you're ready to head back to Snezhnaya now? Oh, please say yes, please say yes. <laughs> Don't worry. I know I can't get my way all the time. That'd just be annoying for everyone else. So... Let's go. At least he's aware. All right, where's my chest for babysitting this kid? This box is cool, though. Yeah. All right, let's go. Ma'am, young master Tuser, I've been waiting for you. Did child send you? That's correct. Master Child instructed me to arrange for young Master Tuser's return trip. Please, come this way. Who are you? My big brother always tells me never to go off with strangers. And yet, when you got lost, you found me, so there. But you've been following us around this whole time. My point exactly. Yeah, that's because I've known who you are all along. Um, what? Wait, how do you know? My brother told us all about you in a letter he sent back home. Sister Tonia read it to me. Really? I actually recognized you the moment I saw you. I just couldn't remember your name. What a strange twist of fate. I doubt it. <laughs> your brother didn't say anything bad about me, did he? Not at all. In fact, he said that if he ever had the chance, he'd quit his job and join you on your adventures. Oh! Stop. Stop. Young Master Tuser, the boat to Shneznaya will dock soon. We'd best prepare for boarding. Gee, time really flies when you're having fun. No. Well then, see you, Miss Nice Lady. <laughs> I'll wait for you back home. You definitely, definitely have to come visit Shneznaya sometime. I'll be there soon, I guess. Do you want to make a pinky promise? Yeah! Pinky promise! Pinky promise! Alright, I guess we're going to have to keep that pinky promise. You make a pinky promise, you keep it all your life. You break you a, pinky a pinky promise, promise I'm on the ice. ice. The cold, the cold will, will kill, kill the pinky, pinky that, once that once betrayed, betrayed your friend. The, friend. the, frost, the frost will freeze, freeze your tongue, tongue off so you, so never, you never lie, lie again. again. <laughs> it's a promise then. <laughs> bye bye too, sir. Have a safe trip. Mm-hmm. We'll see you soon, buddy. Yeah, there's Child. Hey. Child? So you were here this whole time? What are you hiding for? Why didn't you come and say goodbye? Yeah. Partings are special moments. If he spent his final moments in Liyue seeing me all haggard and weak like this, that's not a memory I want him to leave with. This dude. 
<laughs> I like him even more. Still, it is a shame that I couldn't see him off by myself. <sighs> I should have been the one taking him back. I do have subordinates to escort him, but I still feel a little uneasy. Jeez, don't you think you've spoiled him enough already? Yeah. Good point, Paimon. <laughs> <laughs> I can't quite explain it, but somehow I felt much more at ease leaving him in your care. And to think that not long ago we... Mm hmm Ah, yes, I almost forgot. Remuneration for your services, which I really couldn't have done without this time. Aha! So you do have a heart after all. Oh, Paimon, be quiet. You just want more and more. <laughs> One other thing. Don't forget our promise now. Let's have a rematch when we get the chance. Oh, don't worry. I'll come kick your butt <laughs> later. This time, with my honor as a harbinger on the line. I'm looking forward to it. You best go rest up first. Don't come crying to us when you lose all over again. <laughs> like you want to talk. <laughs> Regardless of who wins or loses our next bout, I'd also like to invite you over to my home. Ah, yeah, we made a pinky promise with Tusser too. I'll introduce you to my other siblings, Tonya and Anthon. They're great kids, and I'm very proud of them both. We'll take you up on that offer. Mostly because we already made a pinky promise to Tusser. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm sure that he'll be very excited to see you too. Well, that settles it. I'm looking forward to it. Now, farewell, my friends. Until we meet again in Snezhnaya. Until Snezhnaya.